Uh, good morning. What a beautiful morning it is here in Georgia. And I'm out here this morning going to make a new project. It's going to be a, a blue jean flower pot. I'm, I'm going, I've never made one before and I've I don't even know how to start hardly, but I'm going to try to make one today. And I'm going to mix up my cement and get started on that before it gets too hot. <laughs> uh, thank y'all so much for watching this video. Have a blessed day. And subscribe and share. Thank you very much. This is my Portland cement. Kinda lumpy. Yes, this is one way to break up the lumps. About eight cups of cement. This is my sand. Eight cups of sand. Water. This is just an old milk jug that I'm using, and I'm putting a lot of water because it's going to take a lot of water because I don't want it. I want it real thin so it will soak up the cloth that I'm going to put in here. I want to say I'm sorry I haven't been on here in a while, but I've had some things going on that I, I didn't have time to get out here, and it's it's been really hot. You have to get out early uh, to be able to do it because the sun shines right here where I'm standing very fast. Early in the morning, it's pretty much shining right here. So I got out here this morning early, but it might have been early enough. Okay. Here are the jeans that I'm going to use. I'm going to... I may just leave the legs in there and fold them under. Okay, I'm going to... I'm going to go ahead and dip this in here. <laughs> this is my first time doing this, so I don't know how it's going to do, but I'm, I'm going to try. You won't ever know unless you try. I know everyone's got old blue jeans in around. 
that they don't use anymore. Soaked it all inside and out with your cement. Mix. I'm trying to wet it everywhere that needs to be wet. This is just Portland cement and sand. I didn't put any added stuff with it. Thinking I've about got this saturated as much as I can get it. Okay, I'm going to let this dry. Okay, I've got another pair that I'm going to try. already got here. It's 
very early. what time it is. It's 8 o'clock in Georgia. <laughs> and the sun's already shining on my, where I do my projects. Just try to get it's soaked up as much as you can in cement. You want all the stuff covered in cement because that's what keeps it together. Good morning. I'm out here going to take my uh, blue jean flower pots out of the mold and see how they turned out. And I'm going to probably paint, paint some of them. And this is a different direction than I've been doing. I've been going that way, but I decided I'd go that way this time. So let you see my beautiful rock garden out there. We're fixing to start opening the uh, blue jean flower pots. I hope they turned out good. Okay. You know, I put some some big pots in here, and I'm going to see if I can get them out. I may have to cut them because they're kind of stuck in here pretty good, I think. I might can get them out. It's a mosquito. <laughs> I sure don't want them out here. I don't think I can get them out. There's one. didn't really know how to begin doing this and keeping them up and all that, but I tried this and it seemed like it worked okay. There's the other pot. And I put a piece of plastic in here to hold it.
this is this is how they look. This is the other one, and I had to put a piece of wire to hold it up, so I'm going to try to take that a loose. You do whatever you have to do <laughs> to make whatever you're trying to make when you don't have much to work with. two uh, things. Now I'm going to see if I can get the uh, plastic jugs. Oh, they're going to come out. I think. So, see what you can do with the old plastic jugs that not much good, but I use them a lot. I put water in them to wash my hands, and I mix cement in them. I do all kinds of things. So, took that out to fit, help fill it out. There's my Blue jean flower pot. and black to have it a dark uh, the color of blue that I wanted. the other one that I'm starting on.
dry brush it a little. Let this one dry. It to look like old faded jeans, not new ones. My grandson don't like dark blue jeans. He likes the faded out, raggedest ones he can find. These were some that he he had several years ago when it didn't matter, but. Uh, <laughs> he likes them old raggedy holes in them. They look like they need to go to the trash can to me. these turned out great. <laughs> I'm amazed. I never knew you could do all this before last fall. I, I never had done any crafts of any kind. <laughs> uh, and I waited, I waited a long time before I ever uh, started. And it's 
so much fun. I I encourage anyone that <laughs> has the time or takes the time to try some of these things. Nobody else may not like them, but some people do. I like doing different new things. need one of these little turning things. It's so great that you can just turn your table without getting up. When you get my age, you don't want to get up no more than you have to. <laughs> but I still do a lot for my age, I think. The Lord has sure blessed me with good health and friends that I have made on on my YouTube I'm so blessed okay I think I'm going let me do the inside a little bit This place here is my peaceful place. Uh, I live on a dirt road. No one comes up and down it too much. My neighbors uh, come up and down it some, but nobody comes here much. So I'm out here doing my crafts and Enjoying it, trying to enjoy my life. I'm going to put a plant in there to see how they look with a plant. using this one. These plants, I don't know the names of them, but they don't require much water. And I think they look beautiful in there. This is my my blue jean pots. I think they look beautiful. I think they turned out great. And I love my plants that I got in them. And uh, thank y'all so much for watching this video. Have a blessed day. Subscribe and share. Thank you so much. I, I love that. That's, that turned out great. Thank y'all. I wanted to let y'all see the back and the in the front. I like to forgot that. I'm gonna try to get 
try to turn it on this lazy Susan, but it's not that great. My little one, smaller one. I'm I'm very pleased with them. Very pleased. My grandson don't come back and won't. I know he can't wear that pant pair over there, but he he's not gonna be able to wear these anymore. 